Hello and welcome. I got curious what Filmora by Wondershare is all about. In particular, they have a free trial version which has a watermark, and I could not find the watermark in action anywhere. So let me just install this real quick and we're gonna test what the watermark looks like and what causes it to appear. While it's installing, you can always confirm whether or not there's a watermark, not by searching for comparison or feature list, but you go to the buy or buy now link and then you will see what benefits you get and then you will find the info no watermark and then you can conclude if this says no watermark then the free version must have a watermark. All right meanwhile it is nearly done installing and I got an icon on the desktop and we can start. Okay never mind that just opened their website. Let's go and start it manually. Oh here it is. So we are just going to start a new project. All right so let's start by dragging in two video clips okay can i drag in one nope can i drag in anything anywhere nope okay let's just press import media files here then and at least here we can multi-select okay that's interesting it's suggesting to make proxies uh let's not create proxy files for now okay but that's an interesting feature let's get the cat into the timeline and let's tell the project to match the media okay Let's add the other clip. Let's cut it at 20 seconds total. We can probably... Oh yeah, we just press this. Control B. Split, it's called. Okay, let's select these and delete them. Now let's add a transition between these two. Um, sure, what? Can, ha, what? Here, okay. Heck, why not? All right, and now... We're just gonna export this. Export, create video. Oh, come on. Are you serious? That is a mean move. I mean, a smart business decision, but really annoying. All right, so let's create a freaking free account. It has no, no watermark. I'm just gonna use a fake account. All right, can we now export, please? Continue use. Okay, N okay, now we can do it. And uh, we're just gonna call this wonder test settings as for settings we're just going to use 1080p okay and export ah, and i believe we can see the watermark in action in this preview clip already and in the outro come on so here's the test and this is what it looks like this is a quite aggressive watermark i gotta say this is a bit extreme and now we know what it looks like because nobody shows off the actual watermark on YouTube, they only show how to, well, legally, and some show how to illegally get rid of it. Well, that's, that's good to know. Hope this, and then they add this at the end. Oh boy. Well, I hope this helped, and now we know. I'll see you next time. Until then, ciao!